Well, hi there! It's time to celebrate my own life on Flip Flap on my channel, of course, and I'm gonna use my hands as a party popper here. Oh, yeah! My channel has finally reached the guy you never ever have thought of. And yes, this is, my, this is definitely my first time vlogging here. And yes, I could tell you guys, I, I know I'm a bit autistic, but I could tell you guys, I, I am finally amazed that the hot weather has now came back in the UK. Now, what we all know is, is that recently today, people have been in there, uh, yeah, a lot of people, as I'm saying in this video, uh, sorry about the pollen I've got in the nose there, but yeah, I know I've still got pollen in my nose, but I can tell you guys, eh, I'm just so glad that the kids at my local school are now in their summer uniforms, which is just totally amazing indeed. And I can tell you guys, eh, this has been totally amazing, it's been totally am interesting of course, and I have to say, I'm very sorry for taking so long for the warm weather to go back there. Well, actually, it's not my bad. It's actually um, the way the winds change directions, of course. I've only taken out the calendars from here, of course, because I need to make it more easier to vlog. And a lot of people didn't realise that I've actually got a face. And the big question is, where is your face, Ivan? I think there's a lot of people saying, Oh, Ivan, where's your flipping face, man? Well, there it is there. There's my face, eh? I'm not sure if you guys can see it there. I'm pretty sure you may notice that this is your first time seeing my face. I can tell you guys, like, this has been chronically amazing. This is my first time my having, you know, in a video like this, having a face like that, of course, I suppose, eh? And let me show you something quite amazing on my YouTube channel. And, um, I'm actually not going to do something... Oh, sorry about my, um, funny voice there, but... Recently today, temperatures in my area have been hitting at least around 25 degrees Celsius. Now, to be quite honest, it's now coming down to a mild 13 degrees Celsius. And tomorrow is going to be set as going to be one of the hottest days on record. 31 degrees Celsius or 32 or possibly 33 degrees Celsius uh, from tomorrow. And the reason is, is because we're getting so, so much of all of the very amazing air, all the hot air being driven away from the Sahara, next all the way towards Iberia, and then coming towards France, spreading across Europe, and then we've got the UK. But I don't think the heat is set to last, because on Sunday and on Monday, well, it, you know, these temperatures are just going to be like, well, average and below average, I would say. But nevertheless, in this video, because the heat wave is coming back, we're going to show you this product here. This is a Brunei 2019 sort of product. It's a Trombills 5 pack. It's a Fire Appetite 5 pack. So it's basically based off one of the mascots for, for the, um, the event. And uh, it looks pretty amazing. It looks also pretty intriguing as you can see. It looks like there's a Charizard like dragon with what looks like Falcor to me, honest, I would say. And uh, there's also Trombo, of course. There's some bugs there. It looks like they're burning in agony of all that fire, eh? Let me just take a look what's inside, and I'm quite curious of what of you guys there. There's the um the dragon, Riverlux's dragon. It looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Looks like a rip off of Charizard. I could tell you guys, like this is actually quite amazing. Love the fact it looks very different. No other, you know, other dragon would actually be like. Of course, this is um Trombill. You may have noticed that on the video that I've made on Thursday. It's quite amazing. You may have noticed, but this is another version of Trombill. A different stylized version of Trombell. Love the fact that it looks pretty cool indeed, eh? It's got the um, the red cap as the flame back, but I'm pretty sure it's missing a bit of details. I'm pretty sure that there's a bit of red missing. And actually, no, I don't think there's any red on this toy here. Maybe if you can see that. It looks pretty nice though, that woodpecker. Now, Trombell, of course. There's, look at that origami piece of fire. How strange is that? And then you've also got these two little bugs. There's a little worm. And you've also got this very, very strange beetle thing as well. And let me just check the time here. Uh, I've only got about 27 minutes till the end of the day, so I'm going to have to make this video very consistent along the way, of course. And it's actually quite a very nice set because of the way this has actually been done. I actually don't mind that for the fact that I am. Um, Yes, also this, um, the packaging also tells me it's like from the 28th of June to the 27th of December 2019, but can it be true? Ah. The price of this one here costs about £7.95. It's a Generation 100 toy. They still haven't changed the origami logo, like 
they haven't gone back to the old Circo logo. This is like the current logo that we all know of for the Ethel Fat Origami toys. But anyways, I think that's about it though. Let's take a look at something else. I think it's this one here. Oh, I think this book is all about the Tufted Duck. It's This one here is called A Duck with a Feather on its back head. Pretty amazing for a, um, a product, I would say. And this is the introduction about the ducks, of course. And this is a male. This is a female, of course. And I can tell you guys, let me just have a bit of a peruse on this little brochure on what these ducks actually look like. It's pretty cool, doesn't it? Actually, it tells you about sexual dimorphism and behavior about the bird that you'll actually be seeing in real life. And also, look at the images there. There's a very good um, picture of some tufted ducks there in a Swedish port, of course, during the winter, of course. And there's one of the male tufted ducks here. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it, eh? And I'll show you wisely in a sense. And when I've just made these books, there's the text is very dedicated, but also, to be quite honest, uh, there's some very interesting colours there. Green is all year round, and blue is winter, and um, yellow is summer, of course. And this is what it tells you. This is the map from the OSPB indicating what colour it is. It's such an amazing sort of kind of interesting video, I suppose. Actually, quite amazing. And um, this sort of book, I kind of like it, of course. There's no pricing on these, but what's very important is that they've got stapling in there. And the good thing about this book is that it's actually printed in a very excellent condition here, but there's also a dark side into another book here. It's going to be a totally different story. We've got Prey and we've got the Predator here. It's the Sparrowhawk. Unfortunately, this book here, while being printed on Wednesday, um, I often you know, go to the restaurant on Wednesday and often print things like this. But unfortunately, oh, sorry about that. <laughs> I have to get rid of something nasty here. Um, <coughs> sorry, didn't mean to do that. But um, this book here, the Sparrowhawk um, video book, uh, no, it's not a video, it's actually a book or a pamphlet, of course. Like, this is the video I'm creating, eh? It's a vlog. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, this book here has got a lot of dents because the printer on my West Bight area, which is uh, Norman Lord or M. Scott House I usually go to, has been playing, of course. But, but nevertheless, the greatest thing about this book is that it also has two or double sided pages here, which is quite amazing. And you've also got another one here, which is also quite amazing indeed. And um, sadly, I think I think this one's the least of all dentists, but there's a lot of... Uh, it's a little bit sloppy, the painting, or the printing, as you can see there. And looking up to the other pages there. This one here is um, not too bad, to be quite honest, I suppose, eh? It doesn't look quite um, shabby, and sorry for scratching my eyes, though. And it looks pretty amazing. I love the fact that, speaking of eyes, <laughs> it's pretty cool, doesn't it, eh? And let's take a look at the other side here. Uh, there's still a bit of deterioration there, which is very disappointing, but still quite a you know an amazing book to look at. I love the fact that you can take a look at the um, the very interesting visibility of a sparrowhawk. I also notice there's a picture of a pigeon up there in the corner here. I actually, notice that sparrowhawks are like they're basically um they're like goshawks in midget size, and this one here uh, looks pretty cool. And then, most importantly, you've got the map as well, for the bird as well. And I've got to tell you guys, though, this vlog is going to be quite amazing, and uh, it's actually quite a lot of info here. Thank you, Charlie. There's actually quite a lot of info about this spell hall gear. Maybe I was rushing too much, though, because I had to get back to, um... The reason why I was rushing, because I had to take a shower pretty, um, early in the sense, around, um, half past, uh, seven in the evening, of course. Well, I could tell you guys, it has been chronically amazing. And I could tell you guys, that is one video you have never expected. A very interesting vlog, though. And I could tell you guys, it feels like it's been like a very long time. And I might be talking for at least around um, maybe five or four minutes. And to be quite honest, it feels like it's been like a long time showing you all these products here in this video. And... To be quite fair, this is definitely my first time showing myself with the face. But am I correct on saying this? Like, this is actually quite amazing, and it feels like it's absolutely quite good to have, you know, people being, you know, filmed in a sense, though. 
But the problem with you know with vlogs in a sense is is because when I if you know when I was you know let's give an example here. If I was basically filming myself showing my face, and if I was showing my face in a video, you know, a video that has my face to other people on the site and also outside of let's just say the whole community, unfortunately that can be the most, you know, deceiving, you know, actually Oh no. One of the most deceiving things I could literally just say. Let's just get oh, actually I've got pollen here. <coughs> oh, that's much better. <laughs> um Oh god. Uh, anyways, I would literally say that um uh, sorry about that. It's actually quite very interesting to say that when I'm filming, it's been um quite amazing. I'm very sorry for picking my nose with a finger there, but uh, to be quite honest, it feels like it's been like well, how many months though? It's been like a six or seven months away, of course, and it feels like I haven't been filming my face for quite a long time now. And it feels like there's been a lot of YouTubers saying. Where's your face, Ivan? I mean, where's your own blooming face, Ivan? Well, thanks for the patience. Thanks a lot, guys. Thanks for watching this video. And I hope you guys basically can come in and just give this video a like. And go ahead and subscribe. Because I feel like it's well worth watching this video, of course. And with the products that I've already been, you know, I've now reviewed. It's been chronically amazing. So it's been like a combination between one and another. It's super amazing. Let me just check the time here. Oh yes, we've only got two minutes before I should actually end the video here, of course. Uh, I can tell you guys, though, it is chronically amazing. And I might show you, um, I wonder what the weather has been like, though. So I'll show you everything along the way there. And um, the reason why the UK is going extremely hot uh, at the moment is because, see that there, all that hot air coming from the Sahara has literally been rising. But then what we've got at the moment is that we've got on Sunday, we've got low pressure here and that's because we've got these westerly winds coming through there and that's very important to say there but I can tell you guys eh, that is just going to be another continuation of course I suppose eh? and to be quite honest and to be quite fair uh, June has been very strange and to be quite honest it feels like I haven't been doing many videos in June because of the you know maybe I have but anyways I think that's about that in this video I'm very sorry for taking so long well, I can tell you guys, say it has been chronically amazing, and you guys might have seen my face for the first time ever. Of course, I, I would literally have to say, yeah, I suppose. Well, I can tell you guys, say I don't know what to say. I can tell you what. First off, we're coming up towards 23:42 p.m. Eh? As always, I think that's about it in this video. And as I said earlier in this video, go ahead and subscribe. Go ahead and, and basically like my video if you want to. And as always, hope you enjoyed this video. It's basically the first time I've vlogged here. And it's a good time to basically um review all of these products. Uh, three products in a sense. In this video. It's been quite amazing. Anyways, I think I have to leave this video here. As always, thanks for watching and bye for now. I think that's about it, eh? Bye.